it's been a real challenge, right? A real whirlwind, almost like it, you're, you're in a dream every day. Um, but it, it, it's, it's been a process, and throughout the last year, it, it was different. Um, you went from planning and preparing for something that you didn't know was going to happen or not, to then having to mitigate and make decisions, and then to respond uh, to uh, a pandemic. I can say that it has been personally very rewarding for me to go through this, even though it was very stressful at one point, but it was very rewarding because I was honored and humbled to be in a position to serve this community, to make an impact, even a little bit, but at least that was very important. It's a lifetime opportunity, which I thought I was in the best place to, to serve, to make an impact. For me, I was elected to, to be in this role um, and uh, had this unique responsibility. Um, for my team, they really weren't. Uh, they were just true, uh, true heroes during this process. And they were here with me every day um, and doing, doing this every day. Uh, and so it, it's tough to say one, pick one thing um, that you're most proud of. What I'm most pr proud of is that they never quit. Well, I'm honored and humbled. I am here to serve the community. Um, it, what I would say that this award is for my entire team. It is a testament, it's a reflection that what we have done and we continue to do, um, that it's impacting the lives of community. So I am very honored to accept that in the name of all my department, all my team, uh, who are there and I can say to them what you do really makes a difference so you your everyday work your tireless dedication is really helping change the trajectory of this virus in our community and that gives them some incentive to continue to sprint towards the goal which we can see at this point is at the horizon that we can say one day pandemic will be behind us. During a pandemic, everybody's vulnerable. So we had all these these individuals who uh, were economic secure, uh, but needed help, right? And how how do you do this? We actually did the did this with volunteers in the community who wanted to give back, and they they served right in, in their own way. That they led and they helped us get through this. So um, I think this whole uh, pandemic was a leadership opportunity for everybody in every role that they were in in their jobs. What we've just witnessed uh, was leadership through service for the last really 18 months.